It's a Hellion! Get back! No way. I'm helping too. I told you, Lila and I have this. Get back! Ugh. Would the person inside be okay if we hit them? Slimes can soften physical attacks with their bodies. Does that mean it's harder to defeat them? No, I just meant that the person inside should be fine. Well, there's some good news. Thank you for rescuing me. What on earth happened? He wouldn't believe you even if you told him. You, uh, you were drowning. I was? Thank goodness you showed up then. I should head back and lie down for a bit. I'm fine, I promise. I can get back by myself. All right then. Now we can romp around the ruins without that weighing on our minds. Mikleo? From now on, I'm fighting too. But you don't have the power of purification. So what are you asking me to do? Stand around behind you and twiddle my thumbs? I didn't come along just to be a liability for you. Mikleo. Lila, is there any way I could use the power of purification as well? There is one way. You could become a sublord and place your power alongside mine. And like me, you would need to dwell inside Saray, my vessel. I'll do it. No, hold on now. You need to think about this first. I need to think about this? I don't recall a whole lot of thinking when you decided to become a shepherd. That was completely different. Is purifying Hellions your life dream? I doubt it. I am a Seraph. Hellions are my natural enemy. Is it so strange that I should want to eliminate them? I don't know. Do frogs try to eliminate snakes? Am I a frog to you? Why are you getting so hysterical? Listen to me, Mikleo. <sighs> I'm not getting hysterical. Mikleo. Your liability will be waiting back at the end. Saray, we should go after him. He said he's going back. Let him have his way. This is youth, brotherhood between men! Hmm? But even so, you should know what you did was cruel. Surely you understand how Miklio feels, don't you? <sighs> I've decided! Huh? About what? Moving on ahead. Yes, this is a fine idea. I don't even get what you're talking about. Well, the ruins won't explore themselves, though that would be grand.
Can you figure out how to open it? A door with no keyhole marked with the crest of the Kingdom of Highland. This is no door. Is it? It's a seal! A seal, is it? When authorities find relics or artifacts that are politically inconvenient for the current regime, they tend to brand them forbidden and seal them away from prying eyes. And if the seal was placed there by the royal family, that would suggest the key is connected to them as well. Huh? What's up? You certainly are quite the budding archaeologist. <laughs> yeah. Ever since childhood, exploring ruins was pretty much the only hobby Miklio and I ever had. That Miklio, if I ever discovered anything, he'd run out the next day and discover something else. And? Oh, that's about it. Can you unlock the seal? Oh, right. I think I'll examine the door a bit more. What could this be? Just need the key now. Yes! Well, it certainly is a unique key. It looks just like a knife. That's because it is. Is that a monolith? when they become hellions. But it's way bigger than the ones we've seen.
Whoa! Check it out! That sword is ginormous! This is an altar to the Sacred Blade. It was constructed in the era of Asgard. Lila, do you know about this? Lila? What's that? This is where I formed the pact with the previous shepherd. Really? But then, why couldn't you tell us before? You and Niklio looked like you were both having so much fun. I didn't want to go and sour your explorer's spirit by spoiling the end. And on top of that, I kept silent for your sake. For my sake? I want you to understand, you must not feel obligated to bear the world's burden on your shoulders alone. Huh? So, how does it feel having reached these ruins? You don't feel as excited as you imagined you might be, right? By any chance, do you know why this is? Um, I... well... You do not wish for your friends to share the burden of your duty, is that correct? I guess I'm really that transparent, aren't I? This is a problem that always arises between the Shepherd and their Seraphim friends, no matter the era. Saray, you must understand how Miklio feels, do you not? Yeah. Very well. There is nothing left for me to tell you. Thank you, Lila. And now, allow me to show you the real reason I brought you all the way here. I want to bestow this onto you. A jewel? They are called iris gems in the world of humans. But they are originally known as the Earthen Historia. Iris gems. Earthen Historia. So, can you see anything? Huh? Like what? The object you are holding allows those with resonance, that is, the ability to sense Seraphim, to see the memories that are contained within. They should serve you well as guideposts in your search for the Lord of Calamity. Hmm? But I can't see anything. You can't? Hmm, that certainly is odd. Saray? Let's head back. There's nothing more we can find out. But... Hey, we can come back anytime we need to. Indeed. And with Miklio, of course. The altar of the Sacred Blade. So this is where shepherds in the past made their packs. Yes, though this occurred long, long ago. Is the symbol of the shepherd a sword? No. Why do you think so? I saw a mural once depicting the ancient hero raising up a sword in the ruins in Elysia. And heck, you were lurking in the sword this whole time, waiting for the shepherd. <laughs> well, not all shepherds wielded a sword in battle. The Shepherd's Sword is like a manifestation of the people's hopes to cut through calamity and malevolence and open a path to a brighter future. A symbol of hope. And this sword... Your sword does look a bit strange. It's probably a ceremonial sword. I found it in the ruins. So that's why there isn't a blade. It's just for self-defense. It's useful for, like, training with Miklia. I see. A sword that does not cause unnecessary pain. Though I don't know how easy it'll be to cut a path to the future with this. Saray, this sword is merely a representation. What you do with it, what you slay with it, to understand the truth behind it all is the key. Got it. I'll search for the answer.
So then, is this sealed as well? From the inside? This is an altar created in order to bring forth shepherds. It does not open unless one can wield the flames of purification. Wait a minute. Doesn't that mean anyone who failed to become a shepherd could never get out of here? Indeed, it is a relic of a much crueler era. I see. You have already been bound to me and are quickly becoming accustomed to my power. I expect you should be able to wield the flames of purification by now. So, all I have to do then is light this torch? Yes, but be wary. Those who could not become shepherds may have perished here, but their emotions linger on. This malevolence hangs here like a miasma. Meaning that hellions are lurking about, right? Exactly. Proceed with caution. Okay. Area. They aren't very strong, but watch out for their spewing attacks. Purification complete! Even in the dark. You mean with sonar? Man, I wish I could do that. I can't believe it! There are so many of them! I have no idea. Do you feel any different? A new power manifesting, or a new sort of strength welling up inside you? Do you feel like that at all? Huh? I don't feel any different. So it really hasn't happened yet. There's too many! Is there any end to this? Saray, we have to break on through! Okay. There's no end to them! Give your all to defense! We can still pull through! About. It is time you knew the true power of the Shepherd. What? I bear my true name. 
Uh, uh, this is... Recite that name! Harness the power that flows from it and let it become your armor! That is the true power of the Shepherd! All right, I'll give it a try! Fethmus Mioma! This is armatization! Wow! I can feel such incredible power! All right, time to finish this! Status as a shepherd, it means you have mastered its power. Still, that was way too close for comfort. Gaining that new power right at the last second there. I'll say, I must admit, even I was worried. But in the end, you did an absolutely marvelous job. Ah, shucks. Come on, you're embarrassing me. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, since the Hellions are safely defeated, why do you say you go ahead and remove the armatization? How do I do that? Huh? I can't get it off! What? Is that what's supposed to happen? That's what I want to know! So, you can't read the Earth in Historia. You were able to unleash the power of armatization with amazing speed, and yet now you can't turn it off. Saray, you're just a total mess! The Shepherd's a mess, I guess, I guess. <laughs> Come on, Lila. Oh, there it goes. I suppose once the Armatus has been invoked, you'll just have to wait until it dissolves. I'm sure in due time you'll be able to use it at will. If you say so. Sense the ancient tongue. We're near one. Be on your guard! Hey. 
ันเราเห็นโมนอลิธที่เขียนในภาษาอังกฤษโอเค